Hi everyone, welcome to Board of Tanks with Stewie JP. I'm Stewie, you're not either any of these blokes. This is Von the Burglar, he's back. That's right, Von the Burglar, and he's got the correct in-game name this time. He's in the Super Hellcat. The Super Hellcat's a tier 7 premium American tank destroyer. It looks like a normal Hellcat, but it's got a good-looking girl sitting on the front of uh, of the, the bonnet. No, the hull, the front of the hull, not the bonnet. Von the Burglar's kicking, up, kicking us off today. Today's 2-Up Tuesday, two tier 7s. Uh, and this one's a super Hellcat. Like I said, this is the um, this is the tank that was given out as um, the well earned reward for just before Christmas. If you've been playing the game long enough, you got one of these in your um, in your in your garage, uh, for absolutely for free, just for just for being part of the community for so many years, which I think is fantastic. There are a couple of hiccups. Uh, I think some people who transferred from other servers may have had to create a ticket to get one. So if you haven't already, create a ticket. If you've come from another server and you don't have the Super Hellcat and you have been playing long enough to have it, I'm not, I can't remember for the life of me how many years. It might be four or five years or maybe even three. I'm not too sure. Google it. It'll come out. It'll tell you. I'll write it in the description below once I've uh, worked it out myself. And uh, Von der Burgler clearly got one. He clearly got one. The Super Hellcat. The Tier 7 Premium American Tank Destroyer. It's like it's the upgraded version of the normal Hellcat. It comes with a 90mm gun, 240 alpha damage, 167 penetration. That's with standard ammunition. Premium is 210. And um, is one on a mission for this one? Oh, I think he's going to get 6.5k. Not at tier 7 anyway, but um, kicking back on Paris. Getting ready to start uh, getting this gun to work. He has spotted a few tanks. He's spotted, what's that? Uh, what's that now? There's a VK all the way back there. And you can see Von doesn't get lit there. So who we're thinking you'll be already? Oh, is this going to be a free kill? That should spot him. The ARL V39 gets his first kill. 319 damage. Already with the binos and the camo net, of course, the binos help the view, and the camo net helps you not get spotted. And uh, I think it was one that spotted the VK30. He also spotted the Challenger, and uh, maybe something else in the south. Shoots a VK100 018, gets spotted himself though. Says creeps back around the corner. It's good to see a TD player not playing these bushes and uh, camping like an absolute, um, you know what, on the on the northern half of the map. Good to see Von. Uh, he's top tier in this game, getting uh, getting forwards, getting some. Spotting some tanks and also dishing out some damage. 695 hit points of damage done already. Two ones to score. Both kills have gone to Von. Von the Burglar from 1AR Clan in the Super Hellcat. Today's video is going to be two-way stanker replay. Two T7s. And um, for the life of it. Oh, the other one's a premium as well. I've just remembered what the other one. The other one looks a little bit like this one. But uh, not quite. Anyway, he finds, he, finds a, he finds a T71 CMCD. Which is the, the non-auto loading version of the T7 American light tank. And uh, that brings the score up to 4-1. 4-2 now as the SU-12244 gets taken out by the IKV-65-2. Whatever the hell that is on the enemy team. Von starts shooting towards A44 Beauregard. He was a uh, character in a program I used to watch a hell of a long time ago. A lifetime ago. Shoots him once. I think the first time he shot him. He, he may have hit him or not, but the, the tank went unspotted very, very briefly. Shoots, puts another shot into the A44, the T7 Russian medium tank. The one with the turret at the back. Three kills to Von. Von the Burglar from 1AR Clan. The uh, the FV201 A45 has got the other kill. So he's got three out of the four kills so far. There's lots of enemy tanks in the southern part of the map. There's a couple in the north. Nobody really going for the Leo or the Scorpion in the north. Um, and, uh, well, there's a tank there that, that maybe. We'll see what happens. There's a light. I'm not... I don't pretend to be very good at this game, but I don't think this is a fantastic position for a light tank back up there at A0. What's that? Is that the, M the MT-25? I think it is. Anyway, 4-2 the score now. Von brings his damage up to 1,357 hit points by putting another shot into the, uh, was it the A44 again? I think it was. Takes him down to 144 health. 4-2, 1,357 hit points of damage done. You've got this dead, uh, dead ARL. Is, uh, has died in a pretty nice spot for Von. Oh, I don't know if he's going to get this one. The, that uh, that um, the statue of Fock is in the way, and uh, it's a pretty it's a pretty cool statue there. I reckon that looks absolutely fantastic. Oh, that's, um, anyway, four two. Let's get back to the game, Stu. Stop waffling. A forty four is down to one hundred and forty eight hit points. That's the target that Von wants. That's the scalp he wants. He can he can shoot kill him with one shot. The challenger looks like he might be about to poke around that corner but he's no longer spotted wait for his binoculars to fire up hopefully he can see the challenger he does and it's no it was a super hellcat the challenger stopped gets a shot into the enemy super hellcat of course when these when these tanks were first given out if, if you had any any battle with any tier, seven, tier sevens in it then they were everywhere everywhere 
as Von puts another one in for the tier seven British tank destroyer. The turreted one, the uh, the challenger, brings his damage up to nearly 19. There you go, over 2,000 now. He gets his first damaging shot from the IKV 65-2. Who's, uh, he's having a pretty good damn chickens. That's his in-game name, I tell you. The Aussie server has got some of the best in-game names in the universe. The Challenger shoots him. The IKV shoots him. His turret's broken. Fixes the turret and backs up, thinking, gee, 46 hit points left on the Super Hellcat, which is 45 more than he needs. He's going to get, he's still, gonna, he's still got the carry pants on. 2,089 hit points of damage, plus maybe one or two blind shots. I'm not too sure. He brought in 800 hit points for this game, so considering that, he's... Um, not doing too bad, not too bad at all. 2,089 hit points of damage, three kills. The score's 7-5 of two tanks. Two tanks just get taken out. The FV, the top tier heavy tank on both teams, gets taken out. The Tiger on the enemy team and the FV 201 A45 on Von's team. And uh, Von continuing to keep an eye down this pathway. The 59-16 is uh, trying to poke a little bit. The, uh, the I don't know what happened with that MT-25, but he's no longer alive. They're only up by one tank now. Now they're up by two. 8-6 is the score on Paris. Von the Burglar from 1AR Clan. Absolute legend of 1AR. Having a great time in the Super Hellcat. The Super Hellcat, the Tier 7. It's a, a, a reward. You could call it a reward tank, couldn't you, I guess? The reward tank, the... Um, yeah, the reward tank. It looks pretty cool anyway. It's got that picture of the redhead on the front. And uh, who doesn't like a good redhead on the front of their car, right? He's got a mark of excellence, you can see there. Maybe he's getting... Maybe he wants to three-mark this bad boy. 9-6 is the score now. Just showing great patience here. Just kicking back, knowing that anything on the enemy team... If anything hits him once, he's going to be dead. Uh, as long as they pen the shot. And a super Hellcat, certainly not known for its armor. Another two tanks go. One from each team again. And uh, the A44s looks like they're, they're trying to push the A44 in the south. Vaughn gets spotted and hugs these hugs this building like his life depends on it because it does. Here comes the IKV. The IKV is coming. And he's firmly got his eye on Vaughn, but Vaughn says, no, thank you, damn chickens. Somebody else might have shot him once because I think that IKV was pretty high. Uh, he got the kill shot for 121 hit points, bringing his damage up to 2210. Uh, I think maybe the P43 shot him once, and that allowed Vaughn. To, uh, to take him out and probably help save Von's life as well. Artie's up on 25 hit points. And uh, did we just see an outline? We did. Can we get him? That's his fifth kill. And that brings the score up to 12-9. They're winning by uh, three tanks to six. Puts a blindy in towards where the Scorpion last seen. That Scorpion is going to be pretty hard to spot. It's one of the, It's a very, very small tank at tier seven. And, uh, but if you hit it, though, you get, it's, a, it's a guaranteed ped no matter what the angle as far as I'm aware. 12-9 is the score. 2,235 hit points of damage done. Five kills to Von the Burglar from 1AR, 1AR Clan. He's not going to go YOLOing. He's only on 46 hit points. Like we've said, it's a one-shot for either of these tanks. Doesn't matter if the Challenger or the Scorpion shoot him. He'd love another kill, though. He wants a, he wants a top gun. And why wouldn't he want a top gun? There's the Challenger. And where's the, where's the outline? No, he bounces the Challenger on 409 hit points. That's right. 409 hit points from the Challenger. So it's going to take a bit to get rid of him considering Von's only got uh, 46. Using the bushes to try to um, sort of double bush, I guess, maybe. I'm not sure if we'll be able to put him through that fallen tree, though. And uh, that's what he's going to maybe move up towards. Creepy, creepy. Taking his time. Guessing that, the, guessing that the Challenger may have gone all the way up to B1, A1, where the Scorpion was last seen. Von gets spotted. Doesn't lose his nerve. Just rolls backwards and forwards. There's, there's the there's the challenger. It looks like Von might have shot him then, but he didn't. He got some spotting damage. He got 169 spotting damage. And uh, the, the gun reloads just in time. Von picks up the kill, confirms a top gun, and this is going to be another Von the Burglar carry. He didn't steal it. He's not a robber. But uh, is the burglar right? Von the Burglar on a Wednesday night in 1AR, an absolute legend. And um, now he's thinking, well, there's four tanks remaining. Cromwell back at base. Cromwell B back at base. Maybe the Cromwell B has not. Um, maybe the Cromwell B has uh, not loaded in, or he's, or he's maybe um, game might have crashed. Maybe I'm not too sure. The M44's got a couple of kills. He's certainly playing and looking. He'll definitely be looking up at B1 where the Scorpion uh, was last seen. Uh, the Jackson rolling forward. Von gives the Jackson a little bit of advice. So, mate, you've got the most hit points, 321. The Alpha on the Scorpion. I think he's on that. I think it's on that. Um, in a region of 100 or 150, I'm guessing. Tier 7, there it is. 359 hit points on the Scorpio. The Jackson found him. Something's hit him for 101. He's up with the ja Shoots the Jackson for 245. That is a pretty high alpha damage gun for Tier 7. 
But Fon's saying, don't worry, hold my beer. We'll get it. We'll get revenge. He did the right thing, Jackson. He did the right thing. He took the, um, he took the, he took the, he took the scorpion down to 140 hit points, which is a one shot for for Vine. It might be a one shot for the T3485 M, and of course, artillery probably should have a shot on the scorpion from that angle. I would guess, unless those buildings are in the way. There you go. Scott stunned the scorpion. The T3485 M confirms the win, gets the kill, and Vine will say thanks very much. I'll take that top gun. I'll take that top gun all day long. Let's have a look, quick look at the battle result before we move on to the second replay in today's 2-Up Tuesday. Two Tier 7 Ace Tanker replays. Both premium tanks. That was an Ace Tanker Mastery Badge for Von the Burglar from 1AR Clan. And the Super Hellcat, Bruiser Medal for doing some internal module and crew member damage. You also got the Duelist Fire for Effect. You got two Bonds for the High Caliber and for the Top Gun because he did more damage than anybody else. 2,735 hit points of damage. Six kills for the top gun. 1136 base experience. He fired 19 shots. 16 hit, 15 penned. Nothing wrong with that. And uh, he even made some good coin there. 16 and a bit, 1,000 credits. That's after tax with a premium account in that 10 and a half minute game. Now, I don't think that the Super Hellcat has the credit bonus as well, but it looks like Von was paying full price for his... Uh, did he have Coca-Cola running? I think he might have... Um, but uh, but that's all right. He got a he got a personal mission payout or, or or a clan booster or whatever it was called, or maybe that was just part of the Christmas ops. Anyway, not a bad game, Von. Not bad at all. Thank you very much. Let's move on to our second game, and this is um, the second game. It's two up Tuesday. This is the Panther M10. Now, the Panther M10 is the German. Uh, it might look American. It's got Big Daddy written on the side of it. It's got an American star. Or maybe it is American. No, it's not. It's just a. It's a, some people call it the war crime stack. This is the. This is the tank that, um, it's, uh, it's a German medium tank, the Panther M10. Uh, but it's done up to look like an American tank. It was, um, what happened? I guess that's what happened. But anyway, Flying Circus is, um, he's got one mark of excellence on this bad boy. That's an American mark of excellence. Maybe it is an American tank. Now I'm confused. Pretty sure it's German. Somebody tell me. What am I done? Anyway, it's done up to look like an American tank. That's why, I guess. That's why it's, um... That's why it's got the mark of excellence. Looking like an American uh, mark of excellence. Unless I... Oh, I don't think I'm wrong. Pretty sure it's... Pretty sure it's a German tank. Anyway, Panther slash M10. This is the uh, the German preferential, preferential matchmaking uh, premium tank. I've got one of these. I'll only play one or two games in it. Uh, we'll watch this and we'll see what we think. Uh, Flying Circus is on the road to try to two-mark this bad boy. He's copped a bit of damage, though. Um, the gun, look at the gun, APCR, premium ammunition, rock and roll, and that's what you're doing when you try to put marks of excellence on these tanks, you, you, you get the um, you get the APCR, it's a 75mm gun, 135 alpha damage, 194 penetration, that's not bad for tier 7, bearing in mind this tank never sees a tier 9, 150 pen for, uh, for standard rounds, which is armor piercing, and so you've got the chocolate going there, that chocolate's going to help his aim time, his view range, his camouflage, his rate of fire, all that kind of stuff. And um, every little bit helps. That's why you see when people try to three mark tanks, they more often than not they'll run uh, they'll run food they'll run food in there as a premium consumable. There's a super Hellcat. Going to shoot him a couple of times. Shoots him once. The Oni confirms that kill, and now we're winning two one. One kill to Flying Circus from Daddy Clan. He's even got Big Daddy written on the side of the turret. He's found the Hummel, and he's found his spotting tanks like you wouldn't believe. Two one the score. What are all these tanks doing? Hiding back here in the corner. That was a very, very interesting decision. At least he's got the backup now. He's got his friends coming back over the hill to try and shoot what he spots. And um, at least, hopefully, that takes the heat off Flying Circus from Daddy Clan Clan in the Panther M10. 3-1 the score. 1643 damage done so far. 810 damage blocked. I didn't think this thing had. Um, I didn't think this thing had too much. Um, had too much armor, but it must be. Uh, it must be okay. And he spots more tanks. Shoots the back of the Hummel. Looks for the S51, or is he going to go for the kill? He's going to go for the kill. Why not? 4-2 to score. S51 is certainly looking Flying Circus's way. There it is, and he's, he can't um, fix his crew. He's, he's, already, he's already used his first aid kit, so he's just got to, he's just got to be patient with the, um, with the stunned crew. Two more seconds till he's no longer stunned. 7-2 to score. Three kills to Flying Circus from Daddy Clan. In the Panther M10. The Tier 7, we think it's German, but it looks American. The Tier 7... German medium tank. It's got, I think it's about preferential matchmaking as well, so you never see a tier 9 unless you platoon with the wrong people. Finds the back of the VK30 01P, sets him on fire, shoots him again to confirm the kill, and that's his fourth kill with a score on 10 2. 2,368 hit points. Look at that! Look! 
want to do the EBR. Well, why wouldn't you? Go for it. He's got his loaded HE because there's no armor there for 100. What was that one? 153. He got the. He got. Um, yeah, he got a, a bit of a high roll with those HE rounds. When it works, the, when it works, it's going to work. Enemy team looks like they're trying to cap now, which is a, it's always a sign of desperation when someone tries to cap an encounter battle because it takes about four minutes for one person to cap this thing out. 13 twos to score, four kills to Flying Daddy. Flying Daddy, Flying Circus from Daddy Clan. In the Panther M10, the T7. German tank that looks like an American tank. Tank, tank, you know what I mean. And um, well, some would call it the War Crimes tank. He shoots the T29 once, doesn't pen, shoots the Firefly. He wants as much, he wants as much um, damage as he can because he's going for the second mark. There goes another shot into the T29, and that brings the damage up to 3,000 hit points as he um, as he winds up that very fast and furious game, 15 to 2. Let's have a look at the result. Flying Circus from Daddy Clan in the Panther M10, the Tier 7 preferential matchmaking German. Um, German medium tank, but it looks American. Ace tank and mastery badge. Hand of God for surviving and winning the game, having received damage from at least four different enemy vehicles. The duelist fighter, fire for effect, got three bonds for the Confederate, the steel wall, and the high caliber. Top score that one easily with 3,040 hit points of damage. More than 1,000 more what uh, the second place player did. 1,274 base experience. He fired 30 shots, 24 hit, 23 pen. Nothing wrong with that fast shooting gun. And over 103,000 credits after tax in that four-minute game in a premium account. Premium tank as well. And, of course, there were some boosters running as well. Massive thanks to Flying Circus from Daddy Clan in the Panther M10. Not bad at all. And my old mate Von the Burglar from 1AR, the best clan in the universe, in the Super Hellcat. Massive thanks for the replays. Thanks for watching, everyone. Take care and see you all next time. <laughs>